guys welcome to my youtube channel my name is Mobi Lemweli, also known as Mobi for short Mobi with the bee -E, and i finally decided to take this platform seriously i was supposed to start this channel like a year ago but yeah for no valid reason um i didn't but better late than never so i'm super super excited to start this youtube journey to see how far this channel could grow and to blossom into something amazing so as you guys can tell by the title of this video this is a get to know me tag just so that you guys can have a little bit of insight of who i am what i'm about i did put a sticker tag on instagram um a few days ago and i asked some of the people that follow me to ask me a few questions that they would like to know about me and i will be answering these questions in this video today so yeah okay. before we get into this video if you haven't already please do subscribe click the notification bell so that you can get a notification every time that i upload a new video and give this video a big thumbs up leave a comment down below if you must and yeah guys also please don't forget to follow me on all my social media platforms um why did i say all because currently i only have instagram but anyway please follow me on instagram i will put my handle on the screen and the link to my page in the description box so guys without wasting any more time let's get in to these hey guys so please don't mind me looking to the side um every now and then i am just reading the questions from the side so yeah the first question that i got was would i join idols um no i don't think so i don't think i have the courage to sing on national tv especially like in a competition like that like maybe in a different setting i don't know like i don't know maybe if it was something different but idols like that that whole competition set up um i don't think i'll be able to do that like i never had that much confidence to do that even though i know that i can sing but in terms of having that much confidence and the courage to go on national tv i don't know about that but Hopefully, hopefully I um, get over being shy and this whole thing because it's actually kind of childish. It's so childish because I can sing. <laughs> so, yeah. Alrighty. So let's move on to the next question. Um, what are my pet peeves? Um, my pet peeves, I would say... I don't like people that lie unnecessarily. Like when there's just no reason to lie. Like absolutely none whatsoever. But you just choose to lie i don't like people who are rude unnecessarily because sometimes guys it's not really that difficult eh? like sometimes you can just you know every day ooh -way, ooh -way, ooh -way, ooh -way. um no so i don't like people who are rude for no reason i don't like i don't like it when people lie for no reason too so i could say that those are like my biggest pet peeves um the next question is what is my relationship status what is it um according to home affairs i'm single and i am single so yeah guys I, <laughs> i'm single i'm very very single so ask at home affairs i'm single <laughs> don't blame me okay so on to the next um what is your favorite thing about yourself myself what do i like about myself um i love that i'm a loving person that i am a caring person i'm a very understanding person as well like i just love my loving nature and my willingness to just give that much love around like whether we're friends whether i'm in a relationship with you etc etc like i just love to love i love love like I'm a loving person and I love it. It's, it's, it's amazing. So, yeah. The next one is um, who inspires me. Um, hmm. One person would say that as... Ooh, English. Sorry. One person that I would say inspires me is Amanda Dupont. Anybody that knows me knows that i've always looked up to this woman and she's just amazing like she's about her bag she's about her man and she's about just looking good all the time you know that's what i aspire to be like you know you know just be low-key with your man look hot for the gram you know and make your bag and just mind your own business and stay in your lane type of vibe like that's the type of woman that i want to be 
one day and you know it's kind of tough because i like to talk but other than that like i just really want to have that low-key life you know just be with you you know you know, you know. the next question is what are my aspirations in life i feel like i aspire to inspire like i really i'm one person that really loves helping people like in any way whatsoever i love you know making a difference in other people's lives and touching them in a positive you know way so yeah i guess you know it's just to make a difference in this world and even if it's one person or two people you know um as long as like i've made that you know difference and left that mark in someone's life it really just really gives me that much fulfillment you know i love helping people man like it really takes nothing away from me to do that much for others so yeah like i really aspire to be a better at that because i already kind of sort of i feel like i do in some sense um in the people that are in my life currently so um yeah, I, I think I want to become much better at that and, you know, hopefully using this platform, I can do way, way, way more and, you know, achieve that. So, yes. Okay. Next question is, what are my turn ons? Um, <laughs> I would say physically, um, nice teeth, nice lips and just an overall nice mouth area. Like your mouth area just has to look tops you get me and then um on top of that you need to smell good yeah smelling good and then i can say just your personal hygiene you know you must just take pride in taking care of yourself but one of worry you know you mean business like your nails are done you know short you know and clean your hair's cut um, properly, neatly, or even if not, like, you know, you comb it properly, I don't know, tie it properly, I don't know, whatever hair you have on your head, it must just be neat and look good, and then, yeah, just your overall personal hygiene, you see, you must dress nice, you know, take pride in yourself and taking care of yourself as more, too, you can already see, you would see, he smells good, dresses nice, he has nice, a nice smile, you know, he, he takes care of himself, you, you can see what, hurry. You know, top tier, top two and not two. You get me, Ish, guys. I'm sorry. I've been watching a lot of Tuto and Tolly's videos, so I can't stop saying that. I, stop, I can't stop saying, you get me, you get me, you get me, correct? You get me. But anyways, <laughs> um, next question is, uh, what is one thing that stands out about me? Um, including my personality and my physicalities. Oh, in terms of my personality, I would say again my loving nature and my open mindedness. Like I feel like I'm able to understand things from like you know different perspectives. You know, I may not like agree necessarily, but like I can understand things from like different perspectives. You get me. And then um, in terms of my physical appearance, I would say that my smile stands out. <laughs> now I'm blushing, why? I don't know. But my smile stands out. Like at first I really didn't enjoy smiling because of my nose, the shape of my nose and how my nose would open up. And then also I had, I had really, really chubby cheeks. So then, you know, everything would just, you know? So I don't like how, that that whole thing was working out but right now i do love my smile and i'm learning to love it i'm learning to love my face you know and just accept it for what it is so, um okay so the next question is who and what is my biggest motivator i would say my family my family motivates me to to just become a better version of myself to to really just work hard so that you know, I want to see my family in a different space. You know, there's so much that I want to do for my family and um, the people that I love in general. So they kind of push me to work extra, extra hard so that I'm able to do these things for them. Like, I'm a, I'm a giver. Like, I love to give. Like, I love thoughtfulness. So, like, every time, like, I see something, you know, that a friend or a family member likes and not having that to give them is just... You know so that really just motivates me to be like girl you gotta you gotta work hard so that you don't need to worry about that like when you want to do something for your family or your friends you know 
um you don't need to you don't need to worry about it you don't need to count your coin or anything of that sort so yeah they really motivate me to do a whole lot better for for them and myself of course so yes okay uh, so i'll just be taking the last question what are my biggest regrets um i wouldn't say that i have any regrets as per se like um of course there are things in my life that i've done and i'm just like okay those are not my proudest moments like you know i could have done better whatever not but i always say to myself like in that moment that's what i felt was right that's what i wanted to do so if the results came out in a different way like i wouldn't have regretted it to start with you know what i mean if that makes sense so um what i can say is i do take lessons out of the things that you know of course that don't go my way or i don't know like that turned out to be the way that they were so um i do take lessons from that rather so that i can do better the next time but to say that i regret anything um not, not really hey like i just you know i just be like okay that happened what did you learn from it keep on moving because it's life like when once you i feel like when you when i regret things i'm gonna beat myself up for so long and i'm that type of person like yo it takes so much time for me to get over something so i'm not trying to beat myself over something that i wanted to do in the moment you get me so i would rather just take the lesson and be like hey yo dude it happened it's life um take the lesson keep it moving and get life it's life such is life so yeah so guys that is it we have finally reached the end of the video i really hope that you guys enjoyed that and that you got to know a little bit about me if you guys haven't already please do click the subscribe button you know what to do click the notification bell give this video a thumbs up comment down below and i will see you guys in my next video bye